All right, guys, we are once again at Spring Guns and Ammo, and we're gonna shoot some cool guns today. In case you guys never heard my sob story, during COVID, I had to sell all my guns and everything except for one, and that was my wife's Colt 1911. So we're gonna be shooting a Colt 1911 today. Let's check it out. Let's turn the camera around and check this thing out. So this is my wife's Colt 1911. God, it is so nice. I got this on a screaming deal, and it was my wife's birthday present about, if I had to say, six years ago, about six, seven years ago. Yeah. And for all these people that say you need to break in a 1911, that's absolute crap. I brought a plethora of all different magazines, some cheap, some good, Kimber, uh, here's a Wilson Combat. So we're gonna shoot a bunch of mags all through this Colt today. Don't forget your glasses. Don't forget your glasses. Yeah, that's right at 10 yards. So let's shoot and have a good time. All right, guys, we have about seven mags down, not one failure to feed. Uh, let's put this down. Just open up a brand new box. We're gonna burn through this box real quick and uh, just keep shooting and having a good time. You know, as, as long as we've owned this pistol, I've never adjusted these sights and I actually just tweaked it a little bit and it's shooting much better. I didn't even realize these were adjustable sights. What a noob. Then again, this is my wife's gun. I probably just messed her up, but she can always adjust it. It's damn good, Mike. But you're not. Can't you turn? Why don't you turn that around and film? Film the target, bro. Yeah. You should have. Look how good you're shooting, man. 14 or 15 yards. Let's see. Not bad. All right, now this is my wife's 1911 Colt Gold Cup in 45 ACP. Uh, this gun has easily had 25 to 3,000 rounds through it. Uh, not one hiccup at all. It absolutely shoots like a champ. Um, solid right out of the box. It has a skeletonized trigger, skeletonized hammer. There's no pick rail or anything like that, but on a 1911, I don't really want to put flashlights and all that stuff. Some people do. Me, personally, I kind of like it without it. Eh, doesn't matter. The sights are super adjustable. I really like them a lot. This thing is absolutely dialed in now. Uh, there's no magazine. My favorite thing is just this trigger. Oh, this trigger feels so good and again over 3,000 rounds easily through this thing and uh, not a hiccup we are back at the range we're gonna be shooting the Colt 1911 today in 45 ACP it's my wife's Colt I absolutely love this gun it is dumb reliable it's easy to clean easy to take care of there's not much else you can say about it it's just a great gun so let's go inside we'll shoot a little bit more and then we'll go back to the house with final thoughts. Sometimes you just got to run your home defense rounds through your pistol. Make sure it works good, you know? Expensive lessons. My buddy Jose's first time shooting a 1911. You've never shot a 1911? Never. Oh That's my fine. god. This thing is nice though. Is this the one you changed the grips? No, no, that's not the one I changed the grip. Oh, oh yeah, I saw the beat. It was uh, Yeah, I changed the other one to red, but... Red ones. Look at that. Dang, that's nice. 
All right, guys, we are back in the house, and I have in my hand this beautiful 1911, and I love it. I absolutely love everything about this gun. Um, if I could sum it up in one word, it would be perfection. Um, the fit and finish is phenomenal. You just can't get over it when you hold it in your hands, and it just feels so good in your hands. Let's do a quick safety check. Oh, and that trigger... Oh, so smooth. So smooth. Colt really does make a great 1911. Now, I have a question for you. Down in the comments below, do you own a 1911? Do you like 1911s? Have you ever shot a 1911? As you saw in this video, Jose had never shot a 1911. Um, do you like them? Do you hate them? If so, why or why not? Comment down below. I really want to know what you guys think. Thank you guys so much for watching. Till next time. I'm going to steal this back from me.